Hi everybody, it's Mark Scheller, Top 1% St. Louis Realtor. Okay, I'm in a house today in St. Charles and I am here with my infrared camera. Now, our human eyes are amazing, but they can only see so much. So here is the house with our normal eyes and here shortly, I'm going to flip it over to a infrared view because infrared sees temperature differences and in some respects it also will show wet areas, dry areas as well. So hold on, I will flip this over. Okay, so here we are with the same view from the front door I showed a minute ago. With the infrared camera, this will show areas that are orange, which are hot, and areas that are purple, which are cold and or because water conducts wet okay so this ceiling looks great to the bare eye the bare human eye okay but when we look up we will see wet areas we will see there is a spot there that is very likely it rained yesterday very likely a wet spot okay and then here over the fireplace also right out in the middle of the room right out in the middle of the ceiling we get these cold or wet spots okay so another few things that the infrared will show. Okay, so up here I look at the front windows and the front windows are letting some cold air through, but if I can get my finger in here, okay, right here, there's an outlet above it and there is a very wet, a very cold spot right under the outlet, which looks ominous as if there's water in there. Okay. Ken, is this showing, can you see these orange pathways? So this is the heat vent that's going all the way, this is the heat duct, that's going all the way to the heat vent there. There's also one there supplying warm air through the floor, okay? And then what they did is they removed a wall here. There's a couple of, I hope that you can see this, there's a couple of floor vents right here, okay? And you can see the heat is being supplied all the way up to the floor vents, but they never reconnected it when they remodeled this house. They opened it up. These floor vents are done. They're not working at all, okay? In this wall, this is the owner suite or the master bedroom wall. It is very easy to identify with a FLIR imaging camera like this where the cold air return is. So see that orange spot there? There's no vents. But when we go around the corner, it becomes very evident. It becomes very evident where those, those vents are. That look familiar? Okay, so that's pulling warm air back down into the furnace where it is recycling around. Okay, there are a few things downstairs as well that I wanted you to see. And here's another thing, right in the middle of the dining room ceiling, there is either a wet spot and or a damp spot. There's the door to the garage and you can see on the left side and the right side where the weather stripping has just failed. I'm gonna go downstairs. Okay, so now I'm in the basement. And when I look up into these corners of the house like this, you see this dark purple? That is, that is very likely a water leak that's damp in there. Okay, and pardon me while I kind of fly around. Okay, similar thing up in this corner here where the water is right by the termite damage. And then it's interesting, it's not on right now, but it is interesting to look at the equipment as well. And that is what a water heater looks like in infrared. It's very warm, obviously, okay. And then the furnace, which was just on a few minutes ago, as you can imagine, the furnace gets very hot inside. I think it's showing 108 or something like that, but it typically is hotter when it's on. Okay, that is it for infrared today. Hope this helped. Bye for now, everybody.